Good day everyone, my name is Mahulan and in today's video I'm gonna take you all for an off-road cycling experience. I am in a place called East Point Reserve in Darwin, Australia and today we are going to do cycling in a trail called Monsoon Forest Trail in this East Point Reserve. If you are new to this channel, please consider subscribing our channel and hit the bell icon and without further delay, let's start our journey. As you see guys, this is the information board at the entrance of this monsoon forest trail which carries the map and details about this trail. The total distance is 2.5 kilometers and it's an easy grade. If we are lucky enough, we can also spot few species like wallabies, bandicoots, brush tailed possums, reptiles, butterflies and many more birds. This is the trail we are gonna go today and currently we are right here. We are going to go in this direction, complete the loop and come back to the same place guys. As this place is surrounded by sea, they have shown that too in this map. This is the road which bring us to this monsoon forest trail. You can see my bicycle is parked over there and now we are going to start our journey from here. Look at this guys, they put some signs here like people can trek in this trail but no motorcycles are allowed because the animals and birds inside might get scared of the noise and it will affect their normal life here. Come on, let's start this journey guys. Our trail has started and I hope I'm having my camera in the right direction. Let's speed up a bit and get going guys. Look at the both side guys, there are a lot of trees and bush and this place feels like a forest. Look at this guys, in the middle of the park too, there are a few trees. As it was raining for the last couple of days, I can feel that the ground is still wet. There is a bench opposite to us, let's stop for a while and look around. That's the path which we came through and you guys can see that there are a lot of trees in this monsoon reserve. I reckon this is a very old bench and behind this bench you can see a huge tree which was already fell down by some reason. There are two paths going ahead of us and we are going to go in the right direction. We will be coming out of this path on our left. Let's go! Suddenly it become very cloudy and windy now guys, I reckon it might rain. Here is an open space. Look there, that's the way which we came through. It's an open space here guys, 
which is having a gravel road on which a vehicle can go. We need to go into the bush again in that direction. You can see how cloudy it is and it started raining now guys. Let's resume our journey through this trail. This place is really good guys. No vehicle sound or nothing. What I can hear is only the sound of birds and animals. It's a different experience to ride bicycle through this kind of trails. Oops, it started raining a bit heavily now. Who cares guys, let's keep on going. There are a few information boards in this trail. Look at this board right here. This one is about a fruit called bush tucker. It is also called an Australian ebony. It is said that indigenous people of Australia have used this for many years and it is a bitter tasting fruit. It started raining heavily and now I am here in the middle of nowhere. Rain is not gonna stop me from completing this loop. Let me get going. It is called the Rainforest Trail as it rains frequently here and during the wet season in Darwin you can expect rain pretty much every day here. You can see how dense all these plants and trees are as they are experiencing rain most of the times they are well grown and forest with greenness. Look at this place. This place is also an open space with no trees. That's the path which we just came out and you can see it is still raining. There is another information board about this trail. Look at this board guys. This board tells us about how this trail looks like in the night time. Few animals used to wander around and search for food when sun goes down. We are almost halfway through this trail and you can see there is a map here. This map is too damaged guys. Look at here. We started here and traveled all the way along. This is the point where the bench was. We continued our journey and currently we are here. If we want to go to the beach side, we can go that direction. That beach is called East Point Beach 
and it is a lovely beach. What I am going to do now is continue my journey, go along this path and finish this loop. This is the path for beach, but we are going in this direction. The ground is very wet now with muddy water in few places. I reckon it's gonna be mud all over my dress today. If you notice the map clearly, there was a stone bench shown on the map. This is that stone bench guys. We are going to continue our journey in that direction. Look at the ground guys, how muddy it is. It was a heavy rain within few minutes and it's too wet everywhere now. Even though if sun comes up directly above, this place is not gonna dry easily. As this place is having very dense trees and plants, the sunrise won't penetrate easily to make the ground dry. Guys, I have noticed few kangaroos here. Let me show them to you. One of them already ran away and others are just staying there looking at me. See, some of them are running away and here is this fellow looking at us. There are two big kangaroos looking at me from there. Oh, now they are also running away.
this is the part which we came through as you see here there is a very big log fell down and as it is raining frequently here you can see a lot of algae over this log it is so green and densely spread over this log this log is not gonna get disposed from here it will be here serves as a habitat for some animals and insects and over the period of time it's gonna decompose and become a natural fertilizer Water is everywhere and the ground is very wet guys when I started this journey it was sunny and I thought there won't be any rain today but it started raining after a few minutes and it was pouring heavily and now this place is too wet and muddy this is also another place where well, there is a path going across have a look around this place guys We are here in the point where the bench we saw previously is located. We came through that path and now we are here. We are just gonna head off through this path. Alright, that's the wrap for this video guys. My bike, bag and dresses are very wet and muddy. I need to wash them all now. I hope you guys would have enjoyed this video and if you did so, please consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon. I will see you all in another beautiful episode. Thanks for watching and cheers.